It's good to see you again. I'd ask if you've made any progress with your little problem. But the telltale twitching of your eye is answer enough. You wound me. I've only tried to be a friend to you. Just as to the poor souls here where hope hangs by a single thread. I can mend it or cut it, depending on what they ask for. They're not the only ones ripe for temptation, you know. My last contract here fed me for decades. Family troubles. Not my family, of course. I never surrender knowledge for free. But one good turn deserves another, does it not? To repay you for the soul sent my way, I offer a taste of the truth. Ketherick Thorm, proud father, man of faith, utter fool. On the night the Harpers sealed him away, someone murdered his entire army in cold blood. Now who would possibly benefit from such a massacre? If you want to know more, I could work the exchange of such precious knowledge into the terms of your future deal. But the time for quibbling over clauses and contracts hasn't quite arrived. You'll be limping back to me soon enough. Not with you, at least. Although, I sense there's something your friend wants to ask me. I do. I have a proposal for you. A proposal? If you're hoping to taste my blood, little vampling, think again. <laughs> it burns hotter than wyvern whiskey. This is serious business, devil. My old... Uh, well, a long time ago, someone carved infernal ruins into my back. They are a fragment of a contract. I'd like to know what the full contract says. Mm. Oh, such impatience. It's something very important to your master. But is it a love letter, a warning, or a deed of ownership? I could give you all the gory details. But of course, you'll have to do something for me first. Let me think about it and get back to you. Uh, you'll get back to me? This is important, devil! <sighs> when? Don't worry, I'm motivated to help you. Scars often tell such wonderful stories. I think yours might be truly exquisite. I'll see you soon.